the Psychiatric Emergency Services, and we're referring to it often as PEZ, um, is really designed to be a place for individuals experiencing mental health crises, um, similar to a physical health crisis where you might go to an emergency department or emergency room, they would go to the Psychiatric Emergency Services for that same kind of assessment and triage to help them in that time of crisis. So PEZ itself, the Psychiatric Emergency Services, is slotted to open at late summer, early fall of 2020, and it'll be located in the ground level of Clarkson Hospital. Presently, the positions that we're looking for within the Psychiatric Emergency Services are psychiatric nurses and care techs, um, patient care technicians, both of which are people that we would um, want to have a desire to work with a unique population of individuals with severe and persistent mental illnesses to individuals with um, anxiety, depression, any kind of a mental health issue that's going on with them. This will be dedicated staff with dedicated trained professionals, psychiatrists, psychiatric social workers, psychiatric nurses nurses, um, peer support specialists, so a variety of professions that will really be able to help people, you know, in an emergent kind of situation. So it'll be a really good thing for the people we're serving. The person I think would be well suited to work in the psychiatric emergency services is somebody who really enjoys working with people, who enjoys a fast paced environment that's not the same any given day. It's a place where we all come to the table with a variety of skill sets and the magic happens when we're all doing our very best work. I think the thing that's going to make PEZ really different than anything we've had before at Nebraska Medicine is that it's going to fill a gap for our community that isn't there right now. Our philosophy really is about kind of meeting a person where they're at, um, being there to support them, uh, being a place of healing, recovery, and really having it be a person-centered approach where they're in the driver's seat as far as their treatment goes.